Hi foodies, welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm going to do a lovely stewed chicken for you with a twist. This stewed chicken I'm going to be doing, I'm going to give it a nice gentle stir fry first and then we're going to acquire a beautiful color by using fresh tomato. So let's get started. So in here, my dear foodies, in my pot is already hot and nice. I have here one tablespoonful of oil and in here I have my chicken that I already seasoned for three hours. I have one onion chopped really nicely in there. So I'm going to add this in there. My chicken, I'm going to add a nice dash of fish sauce, just like so. And I'm going to add half a tablespoonful of apple cider vinegar. And I'm going to leave this in here and give it a good little fry for three minutes. Okay, foodies, so it has been fine for the past three minutes. Now I want to add a little bit of this saffron that I have here. It's a very little bit, not too much. And I have here tomato and one stalk of celery in this bag and I have here my paprika, cilantro, rattao, shadow ginger, garlic, all those good stuff is in there. I'm going to give this now a good mix where it's going to acquire its color from that tomato. There's several different ways, many different ways you can make a stew. You can even caramelize with sugar. You could use tomato paste, but I'm not using any of that today. So I'm going to let this sort it on really nicely, and I want to add a little bit of oyster sauce to this. So let this come up to cook for two minutes, and then I'm going to add the oyster sauce. In goes some oyster sauce. really nicely there you go and i'm going to let this cook now for three minutes i'm going to put a lid on and then we're going to continue from there okay foodies let's take a look now so there we go that lovely oyster sauce is in there and everything is bubbling up really beautiful so here i have my peppers i'm just going to break them into these are chili peppers i have them frozen you can freeze them so for the long winter months you will have them and my lovely Stew chicken and oyster sauce, or chicken and oyster sauce. This is looking really nice. So give this a good mix. And now we're going to leave this to finish cooking up really nicely. We're going to add some water into this, but not just yet. Let this get a nice little fry. So I'm going to leave it open now and let it get a nice little fry up. And then we're going to add the water to finish cooking. Let's see, this looks nice now. So now I'm going to pour some water in and let the chicken cook now. Let the meat cook into the water and this should be fine. Like in 15 minutes time because it's chicken. Chicken cooks pretty fast. I tasted it for salt and spices and everything seems to be wonderful. Everything is on point. How easy was that? You can always be creative in your kitchen, my dear foodies. So many different ways in cooking so many different dishes. Don't, don't forget to like and share this lovely meal. Shout out to all my foodies out there. Hi, how are you doing? Come on in and join in into my YouTube. Subscribe to YouTube channel there on Jenny's Walk. So there you go, foodies. That lovely stew chicken that we made there with the oyster sauce and some nice apple cider vinegar and some fish sauce. All lovely. Marinated really well. A nice fry and some fresh tomato in there. Lovely, delightful, delicious meal as a side dish. You can enjoy this with roti, rice, or potato salad, anything of your choice. Another marvelous meal here from Jenny's Walk. So thank you for joining me from my kitchen to your kitchen. Happy cooking.